What's up, y'all? Long time no hear or long time no see. Whatever. So anyway, I have been a little MIA lately. I've been gone. I've been away. So I've been in L.A. for about six weeks now. Um, I'm back home in Chicago, but I'm going to be headed back to L.A. soon. Um, but I just wanted to give y'all a little sneak peek of what I've been up to. So if you're interested, then please keep watching. Day two in L.A., I had some things that I had to take care of, and I didn't have my rental cars yet. So your girl had to look up how to get from Pomona to the city on public transportation. And y'all, it took about two plus hours. But the public transportation wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Y'all, pray I don't get lost. So I am trying to find the 728 bus. So I just asked the bus driver because I don't see 28 or 728 listed anywhere. So here I go. He said the middle of the block. So it should be that right over there. It is. I found it. I'm not getting lost yet. Okay, y'all. So that was actually the wrong side. See, make sure you ask questions because I would have been going in the wrong direction. So I'm back on track. I am on Spring Temple and hopefully the bus comes soon. Hello. So I have finished taking care of business for the day. So I am now at the Westfield Mall. It's like an outdoor mall. Um, where am I? This is on Santa Monica Boulevard. So it is such a cute mall, y'all. Let me see if I can block the screen. I'm just headed to the bank because they have a Chase and a Bank of America right by each other. But y'all, I just have to say, look at my ponytail. Woo! Hair is growing. They're probably looking like, what is this clown doing? Good morning. So it is currently 6 a.m. here in California um so yesterday was a bit rough like since I've been here the whole transportation and rental car thing has kind of been a nightmare so since I'm staying all the way in Pomona everything that I have to do is in the city so you know the amount of time that I'm gonna be here for it was just too expensive to rent a car for the entire you know six weeks um so most of the time I have either been taking Lyft which is a fortune traveling from Pomona to the city back and forth one ride was like one way was like seventy dollars um so your girl has been taking public transportation so it takes like two plus hours um to get from Pomona to the city um you know I tried to rent a car a few times if I know that what I have to do is going to be late in the evening Enterprise was giving me issues um so yesterday I went to go rent a car I need one for like the entire week and it didn't start off well um I rented with another or reserved with another company called Economy yeah I don't even know what that company is. I booked it on Priceline and ended up going with Alamo. So I rented um, a car at the Alamo at the Ontario Airport in California. And oh my gosh, that the service that I received at that place was exceptional. They really hooked me up. Like the car that they gave me, y'all. They gave me a so I am gonna continue to go there moving forward um if you are in you know that area and need to rent a car definitely hit up the Alamo at the Ontario Airport in California um but right now I am up very early and I am actually going to be uh an audience 
a VIP audience at The Real, the TV show The Real. So I am very excited, y'all. I'm back at Warner Brothers Studio. So in my California vlog last time, I did come here for a tour. So now I'm actually going to be on set as an audience member but i don't care on set uh, of a tv show and i know there's no cameras so um i don't know i'll do as much as i can before they say you can't have your phone um but yeah i'll see y'all soon waiting to go in the little push start i mean at home you know i just you know i still use the key you know and i turn it and that turns my car on so um but yeah but what i like is this right here this right here so at home you know my little thing you know you do it you put it in park and you then you put it in reverse and then you know all that but this you just turn the little knob and that is all. So well, my friend took me to this really dope record store on Sunset Boulevard. I think it's pronounced Amoba or Omiba. It's A-M-O-E-B-A. And y'all, it was such a nice record store. I really want a record player now. Y'all, look what I found. Rihanna Records. Now I want a record player. This record store is so dope. It's huge. Look at all of that. y'all so i just uh got out of the well we just finished the indie film festival so everyone's just kind of out here networking and connecting right now um so this is actually my second saturday i actually came last saturday as well um so yeah we looked at about so it's from like 2 30 ish to 5 30 and then you network after so if you are like a director an actor or a producer it is something uh that i it's a good festival i mean it's every it's every week um which is i think it's like the first festival that actually does it every week um it's just a really good opportunity to come out and see um films and there was actors doing monologues maybe I'll submit we'll see um but it was just a really good opportunity to meet people um so yeah if you are in the industry or trying I would definitely suggest to hit it up <laughs> 
So y'all, this is the TCL Theater, which is like the the little theater on Holly, well, in Hollywood, and um, it has like the handprints and the stars outside of the theater. Okay. Ew, it's so bad. <laughs> you want your bacon cooked. I think this is a good one. That one right there. This one. That one. This one. No, yeah, that one. That one she's touching. Yeah, that's a good one. Onion? Onion, mommy? Yes. Everything. Hot dog, hot dog. Get the pico. Yeah. Uh -huh. Pico? Cilantro? Yes. Palapeño? Uh, yes. about to go in there and just get a few things like some avocados some tomatoes um oranges mainly produce um but i just wanted to show y'all the car that i'm in this week so when i returned the range rover last week well yesterday blah, yesterday which was sunday um i didn't know if i was gonna rent a car right away if i was gonna wait um, because I don't technically need it today, but I do need it tomorrow. So, you know, I returned it and everything and I ended up needing this, like, I might as well, I'm already here. I'm just going to get another car because I do need one for the week. Um, so I couldn't get the range because it was already being cleaned. And yeah, I technically could have waited, but it would have been a, a long time. It was already being cleaned. So there were other cars of course in the lot and um so i went to the same rental place y'all the alamo at ontario airport in california okay so um i got a camaro y'all i never in my life drove a car like this before and y'all like I was driving back to the house and I was I had to speed just a little bit just to get the full effect. Y'all, I felt like I was in fast and furious. So I mean nothing nothing much about the inside. Um these a little weird. These are like the vents, but you could also turn it up and turn it down like the temperature and how fast it blows on this one you all probably already know this but this is high tech to me because my little car you know my car at home in chicago was a 2010 so this is fancy to me but i'm gonna show you all the outside so here it is y'all i love this car it is so nice. I really feel like I'm in like one of the Fast and Furious movies. And especially you all know like driving alongside the mountains just like in the movie. Yes. But this is, this is her. This is she. This is my little, this is my new baby for the week. I want to take this and the Range Rover back to Chicago. Who wants to help me drive? So here I was on my way to the Malibu Wine Safaris in Malibu and I had to record this. Like 
These mountains are so gorgeous. Like, can you imagine just waking up to this every day? What's up, y'all? So I don't have a lot of business to take care of today. So I kind of wanted to relax. This is gorgeous. So I am at the Safari Wine Tours. So I've seen this on like TV and I love animals and I love wine. So I thought this would be the perfect mix. So this is all the way in Malibu. So from Pomona to Malibu, it took me a little over an hour and a half to get here. I almost didn't make it. I had to run. So I made it and it's a little chilly out here, but y'all, it is so gorgeous. So I got the Explorer package, which was like $65. We're not able to actually see the giraffe Stanley, but I was able to get a picture and a little video of him. Um, but we're at our first stop, so we're gonna be trying a white wine. So I'm gonna get that. I don't have any process in the making. You don't offend us if you wanna dump it up, you wanna give it to your drinking buddy, if you wanna give it to Nicole, whatever you have to do. Gorgeous. <laughs> And we're gonna hang at and that's the truck we'll be riding in. That I pour at your pace. So whenever you're ready for the second and the third one, just come on back. It's pretty casual. I'm not gonna yell at or anything like that. Or if you want to stay right next to me at the barrels and warm up, that's okay too. Um, we do have some animals. So that's kind of where the people are headed to. So if you want to go say hello to them, you're more than welcome to. And kind of directly behind me is a restroom as well. So just in those 15 minutes, if you want to taste all of them, have to keep coming back. So the first one that I'm starting you off with is our brew. It's our sparkling wine. It's pretty much champagne. I think we've all had it, whether it's alone or with mimosas. Of course, is isn't from the Champagne region of France, so we can't call it that. Um, but a fun, nice little dry bubbly to start us off with. Same great though, Pinot Noir and Chardonnay. So I got my first glass. Y'all, it is so pretty out here. So let's see. I like sweet wine. I mean, it's fine. I'm a more sweet gal, so it's it's decent. But this view, now it's just so nice and peaceful. And over here are some animals. They don't make this for short people, because if I just look straight, I see the fence. But, I wonder why they have the patches over their eyes. Hi, with the animals. Hi, with the animals. Is he coming? Oh. Hi, Snuggles. buddy oh you know what y'all i'm slow this is like i guess to like shade their eyes like sunglasses to shade their eyes from the sun right <laughs> right buddy see y'all know i wanted to be a vet at one point like i love animals but ah uh, the way school was working and the classes and the prerequisites and everything it was just not happening but yeah y'all it's just me and the animals over here Everyone else is just exploring. Exploring. He's nine years old. He's kind of like a Ooh. teenager in giraffe years. 18 feet tall, too. How long are you? Yeah. And not just growing. It's I stand only growing another foot or two. I stand only. Oh, she's less than two weeks old. Because of that, guys, we'll just have you stay like an arm's length away from the fence. Take your photos and everything. It's not too close, especially because the moms are up here. You want another piece? You want this one? What? Sorry! I didn't want you to nibble my hand off! 
Hey, buddy. Oh. I make sure I wash my hands. Hey, buddy. You really can't hear what I was saying because the wind was blowing so bad. But as you can tell by my face, that wine was bitter. I like sweet. I'm gonna tell you. Hi. Hi. How are you huh? I said, hi, how are you? Okay. Good. How are you? Okay. I don't know. I don't, you know, I've never been here before. I'm from okay. Chicago. So you gotta hook me up and don't send me off, please. You gotta tell me what's good and it has to be really good, okay? Well, our menu is pretty easy. <laughs> it's just one, two, three. And this is what everyone makes a big deal about. Is it good? I mean, I love In N Out. I, I think everyone I know loves In N Out. Um. I usually go for the double double. That's what a lot of people go for. But if you can't do the double double, usually the cheeseburger, and then if you don't like cheese, just the hamburger. Does that come? Is that onions on it? Um, what is you that? Like, you can put anything you want in it. It normally comes with lettuce, tomato, sauce, and then onion if you'd like. Can you grill the onions? Yes. You also have a whole grill onion. What's a whole grill onion? It's a, it's a whole onion grilled and then thrown in the burger. So like normal grilled onions is chopped, but this is just like a whole onion. I'll do that. Okay. I'll do the one. And then you said, you said, yeah. you said um, I double double? Yes. Okay. And you said with the whole grill onion. Yes. Okay. Is that extra? No. Y'all know me. You already know I had to ask. Okay. okay. Would you like a french fry or a Um, I'll just do fries. Okay. French fries. Y'all, this better be good. So y'all, it's during the week. And I'm not supposed to be eating like food like this, but you know, I'm just gonna see if this In N Out Burger is what's up, okay? So, and no drinks, no drinks. I got my water. Okay. Eating in the car, yes. Okay, so I have one double double with the whole grilled onion and one fry all tea in the car at 662 first window. Okay, y'all saw the menu. Y'all saw the menu. Wait, excuse me, can you just can you can you just show the menu for the camera, please? I don't know if we're allowed to. I'm sorry, no, I can show this. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Oh, you got it. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Y'all, this shit better be good. Okay, this line is like, you can't see the line, but the line is pretty long. So, about like six cars pulled up behind me that fast. Just that fast. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. Oh, wait, the second prize. Oh. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Have a nice day. You too. So y'all, I don't need to get a bag. Like this is a box. I was expecting it in a bag. Like, like you know. So let me let me park somewhere and put this to the test. Don't go that way. Cause be... you know your girl. Watch, watch me drop this. Trying to. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go right here. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let's see what this is all about. I had to say my grade. Okay. So, Y'all see that? Okay. This bun is hard as hell. Already a neck. No, I should go back. Y'all know I will go back in there and complain. This bun is extra. Look at this. It's hard. No. No, we got to go back. Look at that. It's hard. No. The top part is... No. Mm -mm. We got to go back. Make it cute. <laughs> okay. Sun just off. Okay. New burger, y'all. New burger. Mm -hmm. 
It was good. I like it. I would compare. I mean, I ain't gonna hate. It's good. There is um. I mean, Five Guys. I think. Well, y'all have Five Guys here too, don't y'all? It's good. It's good, y'all. I think it is something. I do like the sauce. Um, it's seasoned good. So, yeah, I will come back. I would definitely come back. I wouldn't say it's like the best burger, but it's good. I like it. <laughs> <laughs>